David, more fallout today against the Houston Rockets after a controversial tweet from General Manager Daryl Morey supporting protests in Hong Kong. Now the team's G League squad, who was scheduled to play in China later this month, those gains have been canceled. And now several lawmakers are condemning the NBA's response, saying the league is valuing money over free speech. Stephanie Whitfield is breaking down why his tweet is causing a major firestorm for the NBA. Over the course of three days, the Houston Rockets went from one of China's favorite basketball teams to essentially non-existent. It all started with a now-deleted tweet from General Manager Daryl Morey saying, Fight for freedom, stand with Hong Kong. That statement of support for pro-democracy protesters was seen as an affront to the team's Chinese fan base. Despite the team's efforts to smooth things over, the damage was already done. Rockets games will no longer be broadcast in the largest country in the world, and Chinese companies have stopped selling their merchandise. What I saw was about $4 billion is the kind of value placed on NBA China. Tolga Orzuchu, a sports management professor at the University of Texas, says more than 600 million fans in China watch the NBA regularly. That's why the fallout from a tweet has been swift and severe. And it's put the league in a tough spot because I think they have emerged in the last few years uh, domestically, at least in terms of U.S. issues, as pretty politically progressive when it comes to matters of uh, player free speech and political activism. Now NBA Commissioner Adam Silver is treading a fine line, supporting Maury's free speech without supporting his sentiments. But with millions of dollars and hundreds of millions of fans at stake, Rocket star James Harden is apologizing. He told reporters in Japan, we love China, we love playing there. Stephanie Whitfield, KHOU 11 News.